Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Retro CD TV. Neuralink is a neurotechnology company mainly founded by Elon Musk. The goal of Neuralink is to develop a complete brain machine interface or BMI for short. This BMI can help our brains interface with any existing piece of technology that's all around us. Can that be your phone, laptop, PC or internet itself? Every time a question pops up in your head, we take out our phones or laptops, search it on Google or similar search engine. When that compares your question against everything humanity has ever discovered at that point in time and provide you with suitable answer. So, in a way, we are already a cyborg. Our smartphone is an extension of ourselves which we can use to search the world for specific questions and review the answers. The only problem we have is the data rate problem. A computer can talk to another computer at an extraordinarily fast rate. We're talking billions times faster. Humans, however, have two opposable thumbs to input text and a single stream of scroll to see what's on the screen. Neuralink is developing a BMI to bridge the gap between humans and the machine. Exponential rate of AI development could cause a threat to human species as a whole. It starts with people losing entry-level jobs to AI which can cause some dislocation in society and things will get a little unstable from there. With Neuralink, people will be able to interact with machines more and be able to get incredibly productive in very little time, all while offloading any laborious and mundane tasks to robots. 17 July 2019, Musk and his team revealed that they had developed a BMI with ultra-fine threads that can be woven into your brain to listen in your neurons. The company has also built a robot that can perform the delicate surgery under supervision of a neurosurgeon. They also stated that they have already performed successful tests of this technology on mice and even on apes. And on 29 August 2020, we were shown a Fitbit-like implant working in pigs. The presentation included real-time tracing of pigs' neurological activity as they smell and eat their food. The tracking of motor cortex in pigs was also presented. The AI successfully predicted movements of pigs' legs from its neural data. This means the data from the brain can be decoded and can be used in real-life applications such as artificial limbs which can move precisely and can feel. The device itself has been updated in design. In 2019 model, it had multiple parts that could complicate the surgery, so they simplified the design to a device the size of a coin which goes in your head, replacing the piece of skull. The device was named The Link. The device has 1024 channels, has all day battery life and cannot be seen after the implant. It also features wireless charging and data transfer, so there are no ports or wires coming out of your head. They also updated the surgery board and procedures to be more streamlined and patient friendly. Currently, Neuralink is focusing on brain-related problems similar to memory loss, depression, strokes, chronic pain, and insomnia. These problems can arise in almost any of us as we age. But firstly, Neuralink will be applied to people who need critical care, like people who have been paralyzed from neck down. These people will be receiving the link so they can carry out basic tasks using a computer or a smartphone. They can contact or communicate with someone if they need any help immediately. There is a good chance human testing of Neuralink will begin this year, and the data and the experience Neuralink collects from this testing, the company can create a standard device for general public who wish to get the implant. The road of phone baking innovation is difficult to achieve for any company in field of upright neurology, as it contains team of engineers and team of neurologists. The field of neurology is laid back and cautious in nature. However, a team of engineers like to innovate as fast as they can to get technology working and fix any problem they get on the fly. Some of the factors that bother both neurologists and engineers on this project is the life of threads that are inserted into our brain. As these threads are tiny, they can be rigid. They have limited working time. Which is a cause of concern because we need these devices to last a lifetime rather than a decade and too much maintenance can make people negate the idea of implants itself. Limitations and speculations aside, this technology does have a real life application today for people suffering from paralysis and Parkinson's and many other life threatening diseases. Similar technologies have already been well known in medical community for over a decade like cochlear implant and deep brain stimulation. 
but the link at version 1 has over 1000 channel that is 100 times more than any consumer device available today. And with Neuralink's constant innovation with every version of this technology, it can be commercially available and automated just like LASIK. Granted, Neuralink isn't a finished technology just yet. However, it does boast a feat of state-of-the-art engineering and neuroscience. Recently, Musk said new videos showing Neuralink's progress would be released in a month or so. He also added, we have the monkey with wireless implant in their skull who can play video games using his mind. So stay tuned to this channel for more news on Neuralink and other technological breakthroughs. Likes and sub to this video would be great. And if you think we have missed any new application of Neuralink, let us know down in the comments and always have a nice day.